are out here at the Palmetto State Armory store in South Carolina. I got my boy Paul the Fifth with me here, y'all. We made a long, long trip. Uh, where did we, we, we went uh, to the Palmetto State Armory event, right? We're going today. Yeah, we're going today. Yesterday was rainy, it was terrible, guys. But we're here at the store right here. We're gonna give you exclusive footage of the store. Get ready for the madness. Oh yeah. They have two locations in this area. I believe we went to the other one in the other location. I think we went to Greenville. Greenville? Yeah. Okay. And then this is Columbia, I think. Yeah. So we are an hour closer to the ocean now from Clinton. Right. And then yesterday we went more inland towards back to Tennessee. Exactly. Towards Greenville. All right. I like both stores. Yeah, both stores are awesome. They're uniquely, they're a little different. Let's go ahead and let's go into it. All right, here we go. Those are the hours right there. All firearms must be holstered or cased before entering the building, guys. I think it's locked. Look out of here. Oh, you going in? I seen you yesterday. Yeah, How you doing? I'm doing good. It's my third day, so. Oh, okay. <coughs> Told you we were coming back to record. What uh, did we tell you? Yeah, because you were telling me about your YouTube channel. That's I right. looked it up. I'm going to watch the uh, 5 7 video later. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. <clears throat> All right, guys. Here we go. We are in here. This is the Palmetto State Armory store. And this store is huge. Check it out. Really, really big. Um, they even have a lot of, I think they have some fishing stuff over there, too. In the corner. Let's go ahead. Let's check this side of the store out. Then I'll show you guys the um, the guns and stuff. This is the ammo that they have. Fioki. You have Federal. Um, they got a bunch of stuff in here. Ammo selection. And of course they have more ammo than this. This is just some of the ammo selection that they have right here. That's that right there. All right, you have your cups. What are these cups called? The like little coffee cups or something? It's a name for them. Carol Levy saying the name for them. T tublers or something. Tumblers? I don't know. Tumblers. Tumblers, yeah, tumblers. Yeah. So you got those. You have your apparel, the hats, palmetto hats too. And actually, I'm gonna tell y'all something. That palmetto hats kind of lit, to be honest. It really. I like this one. Those are some of the hats that they have. All right. They have some more palmetto hats here. I'm gonna rock this one. Oh, you tripping, bro. Them the, um, these, I think these are more breathable fabrics and stuff like that that they have. They have the palmetto shirts here, of course. I, I like this one. I might get that before I leave. I didn't even know they had these yesterday. They only they only twenty dollars. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think I'm gonna pick one of those up. Cause when I do like the palmetto videos, I can rock a palmetto shirt. I'm gonna get one before I leave. Remind, oh, they got all black, bro. Look. Yeah, and these ones right here, these are dope. I'm gonna buy it. Yeah. All right, I didn't know they had those. Mm -hmm. All right, back here is a lot of your hunting. You know things that you need and stuff like that they got the jackets um hats uh turkey stuff you know what i'm saying of course they got turkey loads and all that stuff out here you got oh they got everything back here man this place is huge all right And you got your back wall back here. Everything is back here. All right, we're gonna go out. And I know what y'all waiting for. Y'all waiting for the guns, so we're gonna get into it. I don't see any cargos, bro. Cargos? Nope. It's not the kind I'm looking for at all i'm gonna get some some shirts before we leave though oh wait a minute they do have i think no 
them not really cargo type are these cargo type those are more like jeans no those are too thick all right here we go how you doing good they have the uh some of y'all boys be liking stuff like that boy the little you know the two-toe you know, some some of y'all paul you be wearing these don't you <laughs> you said what? Did the tall dude from Tacticon Armament give you like <laughs> crazy man? His name. I hope I see him today. Oh, let's show him what I got yesterday. What? What's that? I got me one of these. Yeah, one of the knives. He's infatuated with this, the knives, guys. So we have a knife set up here. They have a lot of stuff, man. You know, the Gerber knives. They, I see SOG knives in here too. I didn't see any Microtex in here yesterday. And I didn't see any crates in here yesterday. Speaking of knives, here we go, guys. This is really nice. The Weed of People knife. I love that. Oh, wait a minute. You see how much this knife is? $9.99. The American flag one is $9.99. That'll go with that Glock you, you about to get. That's yeah. 10 bucks, man. Oh, we getting that before we leave. Yeah, we got to get that. I didn't know they had that. I'm going to just get two of them. I'll get that one. Yeah, because they got a glass breaker on the end. So remind me, I got to get the knives and I got to get the shirts before we leave. Yeah. Okay, we have some axes down there. Looks like. Yeah. You know, Nathan gonna go crazy, guys. We have the uh, Kershaw's. I carry Kershaw's all the time. They're nice and affordable, and they have a good metal content on them also, which lasts a pretty long time. Those are some of the other ones they have. Can I show them a picture of me modeling my, my knife yesterday? Uh, Check it out, y'all. That was me modeling <laughs> That boy looking like a black samurai boy. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Some of these knives up there, guys. It looks like 243 for that Eagle Claw knife right there. Okay. Yeah, here we go. These are the big boys. I believe these are bench maids. So we have some bench maids sitting in there. Those are going to run you. These are for the big bag boys that have a lot of money. A bench mate. Yeah. They're nice, man. I just don't want to stab my, my knee with it. These are some of the other bench mates, and I like these right here. So Nathan gonna go crazy when he see this. Very nice. All right, here's some other the ammo guys. So I'm really not gonna go through all of this, but I'll just show you some of the ammo. The prices are pretty decent. Uh, nine millimeter normal, 108 grain for 9.99. They have the uh, bigger boxes you get. <coughs> you get 100 rounds, it looks like, right here for $29.99. 115 gray. Full metal jacket, it looks like. And the Notorious, y'all know I did it on my channel, the reviews of AAC. Because <coughs> you have people talking shit that don't know what they're talking about. And AAC shoots pretty good. This is a supersonic ammo, which typically people don't shoot this all the time. Unless you're trying to suppress stuff and make it sound like you can't hear the shit at all. But this right here is the AAC. I didn't even know they had supersonic ammo. But here it is. 300 AAC blackout. So, um, and the price on that is $11.99. But then they have your standard AAC too. And we'll look at that in a few minutes. So there goes some more ammo. <clears throat> Alright. So they have a lot. Uh, when I say a lot of ammo, guys, they have a lot of ammo. Um, you know 223 and 556 five, Paul, mm -hmm. pretty much non-existence in Tennessee now. Yeah. So here we saw plenty of it out here. Which is good. And I need to stock up. 
All right, let's see. Um, here goes some more. No, that's the supersonic. I want to show y'all some different. Grab that AAC for me. I want them to see that. This is the one yesterday. So this is the AAC 100 count, nine millimeter Luger, 124 grand guys. And this one right here is $26.99. So that's it right there, 140 grand. All right, keep it moving here. So that's the ammo selection right here. We're gonna run into more ammo. Of course, you know, Palmetto State Armory has that coffee business going, which is Caliber Coffee. I noticed they really, really show that on the Palmetto State Armory website. So this is it right here. And of course they have it in the store here too. So we have lady bags right here. Yep, that's kind of dope for a female, this one. Okay, um, let's go around here. We'll go, the, we'll come out wrap around. You have your gun cases. Plano gun cases. Those are really good. Of course, Vault. That's some top-notch stuff right there. You get. Alright. And I'm going to do a real quick 360 so you guys can get a more of a um, realistic view of the store. And I'll pan real nice and slow so you can see it. This place is humongously big. Giant. All right, here we go, y'all. So now you get to see some of the uh, firearms they have here. A wide, wide selection. When I say wide selection, it is huge, guys. All right, we're in the Kel-Tec section. It's a bunch of different stuff here. I mean, you can see it all. You see your Berettas up in there. You have your revolvers right there. <coughs> you got that little banger, that Walther. Uh, P22Q. Alright. We have some more revolvers here. Pretty. Oh, that's the one I have, Paul. Mm -hmm. But I got that on a special, remember? Yep. So that one right there, that's uh, 22LR, and you can convert the cylinder into 22 Magnum. I have that one. I have two of them, actually. Here go another American flag one right here for Paul. $129.99. Unfortunately, I can't get that here. Well, you can. Well, you can, you, you, can, you can get it. So I found out that purchasing firearms out of state, you can purchase a pistol, uh, but then you have to send it to your home state in the FFL. FFL. Yep. Now, you can purchase a shotgun or rifle 16 or 18 inches and above. And you can walk out with it. That's as long right. As you pass your background check and all that. And we can buy ammo, which is a good Correct. thing. So you can buy ammo and take it out of state. So we found that out, guys. If you don't know, now you know, baby, baby. Let's keep going here. All right. No, oh, this one is nasty right here. That's that HK MP5 boy. That's a that's a bad boy right there. Oh, and this is a. I think this is a. Uh, how you doing? Right. Good. Good. All right, got some people coming into work. I'm gonna show y'all all the toys, man. Don't worry, don't worry. You will get to see the toys. And they have some custom pieces that just look amazing, guys. Yeah, they had some Christensen arms over there yesterday. Say what? They had some Christensen arms over there yesterday. Man, they blew my mind. They, uh, they are pretty slick. Mm -hmm. All right, here goes some more rifles. show y'all this and I mean look at that guys they extend all the way down this place is crazy big all right let's look at some more guns down here all right you got that Smith & Wesson 629 that's a big boy right there I want that but I can't walk out with it I thought you said you wanted this one though the judge I want that too yeah pretty slick addiction to this is never ending one of these walthers in here oh so to tell y'all the story okay so yes. this is a deal me and paul the fifth came in here yesterday we actually came in here before we came just to make sure everything was okay and we looked and we were asking questions you would think that it would be more daggers 
you would think it would be more stuff like that but they sell out so fast at the store guys look at this this is the section right here where you are supposed to have your micro daggers your compact daggers and full size and stuff like that sold out and guess what guys monday is the big announcement yep you know what that means saber dagger time. saber dagger yep going down all right here goes some more shotguns and stuff like that for you boys and i don't know if you all know this but paul the phil was kind of shocked if you look through that window they have a shooting range back there guys crazy and i'm gonna see if i can get some footage back there that'd be pretty amazing if i can all right <clears throat> let's look at some more here i love that color that black and green mm -hmm. that's a glock uh Ooh, glock 45. What you see? 1911s. Let's look at them. Oh yeah. Yeah, this is what we like right here, guys. That's Big 1911 like. gang right here. We really like 1911s. And they got some really, really nice ones too. We got that front serration on the top that you like. Yep. And the price is not that bad. I mean. I mean 1911s are yeah, they're not that bad at all. How you doing? You got oh, you got the Rugers down here too. They got that Ruger EC9S. Y'all know I sold that. Not, well, I didn't sell it. I traded it in. <clears throat> more shotties, more shotties, All right, let's look and see what they got down here. What is this? I'm getting a bad reflection right there. Maybe I come this, there we go. All right, here we go. We're in the M&P section right here, guys. So Smith & Wesson, M&Ps, plenty of them. All right, they have one of my favorites right there, that M&P 5.7, I shot that one. That was a pretty fun experience. Talking about 5.7. I hope we get to shoot the Palmetto 5.7 today. The Palmetto? Oh, yeah, we will. Yeah, we most definitely will. Yep. Let's see. All right. Oh, there go. Look at this. Man, they got a Stoger in here. <laughs> That's one of the newer Stogers that came out. So. All right, now. Yeah, I know I'm going to give y'all some more shotguns because they got a never ending supply. All right, here we go. We're in the Canix section, guys. Y'all know Canix, bro. Nathan just bought a new Canix. Congratulations, think, my boy. I think I'm about to get the TTI Combat. Yep, uh, Paul getting the TTI Combat, y'all. That's that big boy. Turn All right. Oh, that's nice right there. Now, that's a brand, I saw this yesterday, guys. Y'all let me know in the comment sections below if you've ever seen a gun like this, but I haven't. So this one is $499.99. It's called a live fire AMP pistol. Have you ever heard of that? I have not. I have never heard of that gun. But that's it right there. So you get to see it for the first time if you haven't ever seen one of those guys. And they got plenty of them. They got an OD green one that looks real good right here. And to be truthful, honest, I love the look of it. It looks really good. I wonder how that trigger is on it though. All right. What time we got? What time we got, Bo? 9.35. Okay. All right, here goes some more right here, guys. You got your Walters. This is for Tennessee Goddess right here. We got the, I think them CDZs right down there, right? Yep, CZs. You have some more right there. You got your rifles down here. Oh, that snakeskin rifle is, woo! I like that. That boy right there is nasty. Man. Oh my God, bruh. Do you see what I see? 
I see a lot of things. I'm you looking at it, you just looked at it. We about to go to it. They gotta see this. Hold on guys, I got something to show y'all. Let me show y'all these pistols real quick. All right, right here we in a Sig Sauer P365 section and a bunch of different ones. Here we go. They got some nice SIGs out here too. That boy real sick. That SIG, um, I like that, man. That uh, SIG M17X series. Have you seen one of these? I have not. You see the um, red that they got on this? Mm -hmm. Man, that flat dirt earth color, nasty. Color. Man, I need this for my video. Yeah, they got some stuff, y'all. Y'all just don't know. If you've never been to a Palmetto store, you better come out here because they really have some stuff. All right, so get ready for this, guys. This right here is lovely. If I can get closer to it for you to show you, that one right there. You see it, Paul? Mm -hmm. Man. Oh, I know what that is. That's a, um, it's, it has a Q on it. I think it has a correlation with Honey Badger or something like that, the same brand manufacturer. I think because it has a Q on it that, and the honey badger's got that Q on it yeah buddy that's a bad boy right there yeah <clears throat> all right what we get oh I almost skipped it we got FN section FNs shot my first FN last summer thanks to Mr. White yep, yep sir if y'all go to my community section we finally we're able to hold the Beretta APX. That's it right there. The Beretta APX that I have that they're running that deal and them rebates on. That black and green one right there. Okay. We got some more 1911 heaven over here. Good. You got your small little poppers right here. Look at those. Yeah, now here we go right here, guys trying to get it where it's not a reflect you know what let me go this way so they can really see it there we go all right i think they had these on the website i seen those i did i did some shorts with those remember they these are at high caliber uh -huh. in nashville yeah i saw those they got three of them here though but there they only have one go right here man they got some stuff y'all man here come the MPs right here bad boys boy wait this one right here what is this yeah, AP5, AP5. All right. There's some creature type stuff over here. Yeah, that's a big one right there, boy. We have some right here with the engravings that look real good. John Wick type stuff there. Straight John, John Wick. Kira Harkin. Y'all can see it through this glass. I'm trying to not get a reflection. <clears throat> we got the big boy bangers right here. That's them uh, Desert Eagles right there, boy. Mm -hmm. That's crazy. Show them the... Uh... Now, I got something to really show them right here. Yeah. You know what time it is on this. Mm -hmm. This one right here is a freaking gold AK-47, man. Stop playing with them, man. Go with that beautiful light wood. <clears throat> Man, this is nasty, Pa.
How you doing, man? This is a sweet one right here, guys. Yeah, so that one is really, really nice. Then here you go. You have your slides right here. Um, it looks like you have the uh, it says Zephin Precision RTS G18s and stuff like that. Your bulk carrier groups are down here. You have your carbon, looks like carbon buffer tubes. You have some hand guards down here that are carbon also. And your barrels. Real nice. Silver and gold. I got some more bangers right here for you guys. Now, they have one AK-47 right here, you all. When I tell you it's so beautiful, it is beyond beautiful. Unfortunately, I can't get it right now, but it's right there in behind that red one and that brown one. This thing is crazy. More shotguns at the top. You got your PS90, I believe that is right there, it looks like. <laughs> All right. Well, the gun Santa Claus came, and guess what he did? Pulled these down for me, guys. Unfreaking real. Look at that. And look at how it's engraved. Look like it has a samurai or something on it. Yeah. Unbelievable. The craftsmanship in that is just crazy, guys. 762 by 39, I believe, is the banger on that one. Here we go. Here's another one. Look at that heat shield right there. Straight Gucci, straight Gucci AK-47 on this one. And I believe they have the folding brace on this one, if I'm not mistaken. Triangle stock on this one, guys. Yes, this is just, it's just a beauty, man. Look at that. Man. So dope. I love it. All right, here we go, guys. We got some more here. Like the store is about to start to open up, it looks like. We got the cans here. We don't open till 10, though, so. Look, we got some more stocks over there, some hand guards, stuff like that. You got your red dots down here. Optics. And that's good there. Okay, right here, of course, you have a lot of mag pull. You have more accessories down through here. Bunch of other accessories there. All right, check this out. You have a bunch of different color uh, hand guards and stuff like that, which is really, really cool. Paul bought a trigger guard yesterday, which was like an olive green color trigger guard. They had different color charging handles. Pretty dope. Got a buffer tube that was a uh... OD green yeah. and uh, carbon fiber. Yeah, that yeah. thing was slim. Yeah, they got different in the different stores. Yeah. You have your pistol grips right here, and check that out, guys. They got different colors. Look at that. Real slick, man. Four grips, red. Different colors there. <laughs> Who wants some beef jerky? I wish they had packed some squirrel in here with some fur on it. I would eat it. What else they got? Iowa uh, Smokehouse. 
All right, there go your oils. Yeah, I happened to get the last one yesterday. Lubricants, I don't think they had a smaller ones anymore. Okay. We got a bunch of lubricants here. This is what I use on my guns, guys. So the cleaning solvents and the, the uh, oils, stuff like that. But I don't work for Hope, so it's, it's many different types out there. You got greases, oils, all type of stuff that you can use. Yeah. <clears throat> all right. Oh, let me dodge you so you don't get in the film. <laughs> Y'all be acting weird about that. We got the ammo section right here. All right, and I was able to find steel ammo, guys. They have steel ammo, and I bought a ton of it. 762 by 39. Man, I'll let y'all see some of the prices. They got 308, seven millimeter, pretty much everything you freaking need. 350, 30-06 is out here. I mean, they got a, they got a lot of stuff. What time we got, Paul? Now I'm 47. Okay. 48. All right. Look at that. They got the 40 Smith and Wesson, 24.99. Oh, here goes some AAC right here. AAC, 180 grain. This is <clears throat> um, 50. Oh, 10 millimeter. So I might get some of that before I leave, maybe, because I don't feel like ordering it. We got some more. I gotta buy that Palmetto shirt though, so when I do my reviews. We got the CCI right here. Let's see what CCI is going for. You got the 22LR Stingers, $8.99, y'all. And you get, looks like you get a total of, uh, how many, Paul? 50 cartridges. Yep. So, I mean, they, they, look at that. They got a whole aisle dedicated to this. But it's even more. I mean, it's more ammo out here, guys. All right, here goes some of the some more aisles that they have here. Uh, and that's it right there. So this is the store, guys. This is a store. When I tell you it's huge, it is big. It's a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful store, man. I mean, they even have sunglasses and stuff like that. Look at this. <clears throat> the whole section dedicated to it. Sunglasses. You know. I wonder if they have any Oakleys out here. I don't think they do. Stuff like that. So, earplugs. You can even get some of the earplugs. So, yeah, this is nice. What you think about it, Paul? What you think about the store, bro? I think I want to move to South Carolina and apply. There you go. No, we ain't trying to. No, we ain't, we ain't working no more. <laughs> that, that's over. I, I, I do my own thing. Yeah, we do our own thing now. We make our own money now. So but I do love the store. Josiah, thank you for getting this all set up. Yeah, he really hooked that love. up. We appreciate that to the entire Palmetto staff. Thank you for letting us uh, come out here, tour the facility, see all the greatness that is. My heart is happy today. Yes. To a. We've been Not buying too much play. shit though, honestly. I have. Yeah. <laughs> We've but been down here. Now that, you know, I got that money, I just shake it off. There you go. All right, y'all, so this is it. This is a store I don't even want to leave right now, but I have to. Let's look at this of education raffle. So they even have this going on. That's it right there. All right, guys, so I appreciate you all watching the video to the end. Again, big shout outs to Palmetto State Armory. Big shout outs to Josiah for allowing us to come down here and record this footage. It is an amazing store. Even the other store, you guys gotta check out the other store too. That store is unique, like I said before, in its own way. So please like, comment, subscribe. Yes, sir. Smash that notification bell so when I roll out the latest videos, you'll be able to receive them. And remember. <laughs> Hey, you do. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs>